That accident has some local schools double checking the safety of their stages. Plymouth High School also has an orchestra pit. When the superintendent there heard about what happened in Westfield, he knew they had to make sure everything was okay. WSBT 22's James Thorne is here now. And James, the superintendent says their stage is fine. And it's a good thing too, Rick, because students will be putting on a variety show next weekend. The superintendent says it's their policy to check the stage before every performance. I feel pretty safe back there, honestly. Leon Olszewski is a student at Plymouth High School. He's involved with stage production, so he's been on it many times. We're sawing, we're driving screws in and out, we're painting stuff. Plymouth High School used to have a stage with a pit just like the one that collapsed, but now they've got one that's more structurally sound. It has legs throughout. Uh, as a matter of fact, it will hold 125 pounds per per square foot. The superintendent says the stage that collapsed didn't have a substructure and it's held up by a wooden lip. The one in Plymouth is different. For starters, it has support underneath. There can be about 75 people in the pit if they're dancing. Um, if they're not dancing, you could hold about 400 people on the pit. Even though they believe their stage is safe, the superintendent didn't want to take any chances. He says the director of operations and others crawled under the pit to make sure all the supports were good and everything else was fine too. It's much sturdier and uh, less likely for an accident like that to happen. There would have to be a lot of things that would go wrong before something like that could happen. Students like Olszewski say they're glad to know the school is taking their safety seriously because the stage at Plymouth High School gets a lot of use. I've been under the stage and everything and I've seen I, we, we had to take the pieces out of the pit and everything and like it's pretty thick and I don't see any way how that can break. The superintendent says they also did some remeasuring just to verify how many people could be on the stage over the pit. Plymouth's Variety Show is next Friday and Saturday at 7.30 in the evening. In the studio, James Fillmore, WSBT 22 News.